I'm going to just start calling here. Ryan Kellip here, I'm going to call on you first. Question. Uh, Kirk, can you take me through the, the last play and what was kind of the design there and, and what was kind of going through your mind? Back screen to Zoo. If Zoo is not open, I pop out and shoot the three. And, and Kurt, I mean, this is obviously the game didn't end how you wanted to, but you had a you had a pretty good day from the field. I mean, what what did you how did you feel out there? Uh, I think when the team loses, we don't have to talk about myself. Uh, so this doesn't matter how I felt or how how my performance was. Facts is that uh, we lost with two points, and uh, it is what it is. <laughs> Jason Shear, you're next. Jason Shear. Or how, how frustrating are these one possession losses? Is there a reason why you point to us to maybe you can't get that one extra stop to, to make the difference? Sorry, I, I didn't hear. It was just How frustrating are like the, the one possession losses where you have to make a couple stops at the end and, and just kind of can't get over the hump, so to speak? Oh, uh, of course it's hard because one position, you start looking all the game, all the little details, little mistakes we did, and basically these little details cost us the game. So uh, one position game losers are, are always the, the worst. Once again, please use the raise hand function to get questions in for Azulis or Kerr. Ryan Kellop here, we'll go back to you. Yeah, you two guys had you had some pretty good connections during the game. Just curious, uh, what your chemistry is like. We know each other for for a long time, so we had camps, we had games, so we feel each other good. So I don't know, just he sees me, I see him. That simple. So how long have you guys, you said that, how long have you guys known each other? I mean, when, have you ever played together before or against each other? Uh, we know each other for a very long time. Uh, Four years? No, longer. <laughs> longer for sure. We started already playing all this, uh, all this, uh, when we were U14, U12, all this. Uh, when we were really little, we had games against each other. Uh, then the national team, so... <laughs> And then another camp, so we know we know each other a very long time. So he's a really good friend, and he's an even better player. And I also agree that our connection is really good. Um, he sees the floor. He's he has really good IQ. He can pass the ball for a big man really good, and uh, he's a tough player. And Kerr, how do you uh, kind of feel out there? I mean, you obviously had to sit out so long, and and now to come back. I mean, do you feel like you're you're in the groove, or you're still kind of getting adjusted to things? Uh, I'm. I'm really far from my game shape for sure. Uh, it's still game by game that game by uh, game I get better and uh, more confident. So and this was already my third game. And what I also like to add here is that I really like the way we play. I really like our offense. I like our defense. And considering we don't have two really good players who are injured. Uh, I believe we can make really good damage next year. So I'm really excited for upcoming years and uh, finish this strong, uh, finish this year off strong. And what's, what's the biggest challenge of having to sit out that many games and then all of a sudden getting thrown into the fire like that? Uh, what's the biggest challenge? Yeah. I mean, now it's already better because I know that I have chance to play. Before it was mental, it was really tough because you practice, you work hard every day. You're just like everybody else. And then when the game day comes, then you just have to hype everybody up and be on the bench for them and can't step myself on the court. So it was mentally a really tough challenge for me, but I don't really look back anymore because, yeah, the time has come when I can play. And the intensity that you play with uh, seems to be really contagious. I mean, why is that like a big part of your game? Um, I mean, that's the way I play. I've been playing like this uh, all my life. Uh, uh, and uh, if it's contagious, I, I mean, it's good. I like that my team is really energized and they actually want to play. So so if you're a tough team, 
I think uh, I think we're a really really good team. All right, thanks guys. We'll move on here. Thanks.